Another great way to enumerate users and other information against a domain controller or other Windows server is to abuse SMB null sessions. SMB is the server message block protocol, which is the protocol Windows uses to share files, printers, and even logon information over a network. An SMB null session is a misconfiguration that allows you to make SMB queries without providing any credentials to the Windows server. This enumeration technique is similar to the LDAP anonymous search, but instead of anonymously querying LDAP on port 389, which is typically only open on domain controllers, we are querying SMB on port 445, which will be accessible by usually any Windows server. If SMB null sessions are enabled, we have three easy ways to abuse this and grab a list of all the users. The first is through a tool called RPC Client, which we can run this command here to connect to our domain controller on 10.10.10.161 with a blank user and blank password. Once we've quote unquote authenticated anonymously, we can run the query enumdom users, and this will provide us a list of all the users on the server. Another way we can gather a list of users on the server is by using the tool enum4linux. This tool we can combine with grep to get a cleaner list of users as our output, and we can do so by using the following command. Since we're using grep to filter out all the noise, this command should give us a list of all users on the server and a clean list. If you compare this list to my last video, you'll notice that we picked up on an additional user that may come in handy for completing the 4 CTF on Hack the Box. The last tool I'll showcase to grab a list of users with SMB null sessions is by using crackmapexec. We can simply run the command crackmapexec smb 10.10.10.161 users to get a list of all users on the machine. Feel free to use any of these techniques to abuse SMB null sessions and enumerate domain information in your labs and CTFs.